In Romans 8, 28, it says, We know that in everything God works for good. Now here's the next line, and it's often misinterpreted. With those who love Him. People interpret that, that God only loves people that love God. This is not human love coming from God. It is unconditional. Do you know that God loves you even if you don't love God? That God loved you in the past even when you were making mistakes? God is an all-loving God. And often we put our human attributes on God instead of God's attributes on us. Now I'm going to continue. Who are called according to God's purpose. You have God working in your life, my friend, actively adjusting, actively improving all conditions and situations in your life. But you and I have to work with God, and this is where the loving God comes in. We have to take God into our heart and, and, and have that attribute placed on us, as the Bible says, put on the Christ. Often, people walk through life holding in their mind disturbing feelings or thoughts about some situation or about someone, someone that has treated them poorly, perhaps, and they carry the burden with them wherever they go. And it just seems like more bad things happen to them. It is the law of attraction. They, they literally are uh, like, like the Peanuts character with the black cloud hanging over. And they'll attract storms into their life. When we allow the brightness and the light of God in and through us, storm clouds go away. I want you to think for a minute about God working in and through you and how God's law of perfect love is put into operation. When this happens, you don't have those clouds over your head any longer. You're not burdened. You can release the thought that you must go through a great struggle in order to correct a perceived wrong. You let go. And you let God and God's law of love bring about the right outworking in your life. Now you go through forgiveness, but forgiveness is more than what we generally think of. Forgiveness in 2010 language means release. It is a self-release inside of you, so... You release, following God, all anger. You release impatience. You release irritation. And when you do, a healing begins to occur within you, within your thoughts and within your feelings. You allow the process of healing to unfold inside of you. And you have the attributes of God of being happy, healthy in body and mind, whole and free. In your life, you follow God by looking forward, not backward. You begin right where you are, this moment, watching this video. You begin to appreciate all your blessings from God. This is loving God. And you give thanks for God's love actively in your life. And all that is happening good now and in faith looking ahead in the future. And so it is.